Hey everyone, what's up? It's Amber right here, and I would like to show off the uh, sprite animation thing that I have now um, for my game engine. Okay, so there are no limits to the size of your sprite sheets, uh, horizontal or vertical frames. You actually determine the frames through here. So like, let's say you wanted to make a uh, standard walking animation. Right now, you can see the uh, character here is turning. So let's go ahead and change that. Let's just go ahead and make it uh, where it's, this walks up and down. Or, you know, we don't even need to delete those. These are our frames 0, 1, 2, and 3. So, we are going to do frames, uh, we're going to play through frames 0 through 3. Now, as you can see, the character's walking down. And you see how the character kind of slid uh, to, from the left to the right there? That's because I have actually programmed in collision as well. Um, you can check for a collision, and you can also do a division thing. Which means you can crunch them closer together if you wanted. So let's do a division by 1.5. Uh, then it's only going to detect the collision when they're closer. If you do divided by 2, it's not going to detect... Well, it is... No? Oh, 1.2, sorry. <laughs> if you do it by 2, it's not going to detect it at all because they're not close enough. Uh, let's do 20 and 24. As you can see, now the uh, collision will stop there. That's when the collision gets detected within the uh, smaller range. So let's do divide by 4. As you can see, the more you divide it, the closer they get. So that's pretty cool. Um... The collision detection works and all that. Lots and lots of fun, cool stuff. And uh, again, the animation here, you can kind of change the speed if you want to. Let's do it to 15. <laughs> um, and again, there is no limit to um, to the amount of frames. So like if you had a Mega Man sprite or if you had anything like that, you can easily uh, animate that sprite uh, through the frame control. That's pretty cool. Uh, if you want to change a frame's dimension, uh, I'm working on that. I'm like, I'm working on a function for that, but, um, yeah, you, you'll be able to do that soon. <laughs> so I'll see you guys later. Thank you all so much for watching. Peace out. And, uh, you can see the frame information over here in the console log if you wanted to. <laughs> see you guys.